Guys, in this video, we are taking this cheap but very good WL Toys 4x4 monster truck buggy thing. We're gonna stick some cheap sand paddles on it and we're gonna take it to the beach and we're gonna give it a rip. So this is the WL Toys, I think it's the 104001 or something like that. It's meant to be a one temp scale. It's more 112 scale. It's brushed, but it's very good. It's got oil shocks. It's got metal A-arms on it. It's got a 550 brushed motor, two-in-one ESC, a five-wire standard size servo. Not ideal electronics, but this is relatively well-priced and they do the job. A heat sink on the motor, four-wheel drive, oil shocks, wheelie bar, front lights, roof lights, and rear lights. The wheels and tires are from AliExpress, and I'm pretty sure they use this in the picture for them. And that's why they're that color, because they are designed for this. So they should fit exactly the same size as these stock ones. So we're going to get them fitted and we're going to take it to the beach. I'm not doing anything else to it. I'm running it stock. And the reason I'm running it stock is because with a lot of my stuff, I convert them to brushless. And I know not everyone does that. So what I want to do is take this stock to the beach with the sand paddles and show you how it performs in stock form. Because not everyone converts their stuff to brushless. The only difference is I'm going to be running it on a 2S LiPo rather than the two cell lithium ion it comes with. So it will give it a bit more punch. That fits on there nicely. Right, I'm going to get the other four fitted and this thing's going to look so cool. It is looking sweet. There's something about sand paddles. They just look so good on any RC, don't they? This thing's going to look cool ripping along the sand. So the battery compartment's underneath on this is quite big. Uh, I'm going to change the Deans over to an XT60 so I can get my 2S LiPos in. Let's go and rip up some sand. I've just had the uh, the one four, uh, the one two four zero one six, and I got 50 mile an hour on 3S. This is not anywhere close to that, but it's got a big old brush motor in there. It's going well. This is a uh, a cheaper option than that one two four. Let's take it out on the flat stuff. It's a bit quicker. Plenty of grit with them paddles. <laughs> this is decent. Decent for a little brushed one. Signal's not the best on this transmitter. I've just, uh, the V2s, uh, much better uh, range on them. <laughs> so running the 2S LiPo of this, it comes with a, a lithium ion. The LiPo will give it a bit more punch but it's decent. <laughs> that little 124 I've just had out, it had that much power on 3S, it um, blew the tyres off. <laughs> I don't think we're going to blow the tyres off on this one. It keeps cutting out, I don't know if it's a signal. But... So this is soft sand here, and as you can see, coping all right. Oh, it does keep, why does it keep, maybe it's that lipo, I don't know. Or it might be, is it a, has it got a, I don't know if it's got an overload. Maybe it's quite heavy in this sand, but hmm, it does keep cutting out, which tells me it may be a little bit too much for it on this sand. There's no way it's used that whole lipo in five minutes, surely. Surely not. Let's stick another one in it. So change the lipo. Oh, that's good. That's better. I think that lipo was a bit of a dud. Got a bit more power now. <laughs> that's better. Yeah. Anyway, with brush power, I don't know whether it's got quite enough um for beach running, especially with a small battery, but um, it's good fun though. And these tires and wheels are definitely a good value for money. Whoa.
guys, that is the WL Toy 10004, whatever. Uh, that thing's really good fun. Because I'd just done the video of that before I started the video of this one, it initially seemed a little bit slow, but it is only brushed. But after a few minutes running, it was actually really good fun. And as you can see, it got some decent air as well. So I'll leave a link to this. I'll also leave a link to the wheels and tires. These wheels and tires are pretty much the same size as the two wheel drive Rustler. So it doesn't matter if you've not got one of them WL toys. These are a standard 12 mil hex. So they will fit on there perfectly. Do you know what I'm doing next time I go to the beach? I'm taking my brushless Rustler two wheel drive and we're gonna give it a rip on the sand. Cheers for watching guys, I'll see you next time.